What their name will be, we still don't know. The Giants fans need to put on their big boy pants and grow. And it's been Batman forever since the Cowboys won the big show. You are now watching a Philly Fuego production. Gracias amigos. Fly Eagles fly. Welcome to the Nest Out West, where Eagles fans are always the best. The true diehards, they know what I mean, cause once you're in, you always bleed green. Now I don't want to sound too cocky, but I'm going to bring the content like Rocky. Body shot, body shot, left to the chin. I bring the heat cause I'm in it to win. It's your boy Philly Foothills here, with a side of fuego for the cheer. And we want to thank you all so very much for a great first year. Yeah. What is good? What is going on? And what is cracking? I am Philly Foothills, and I am back in. I'm out here in the barn. What's going on, y'all? Just wanted to make a uh, pretty quick video. Just kind of catch up on some, a couple of things from the last couple of days. Sorry I've been uh, um, away from you guys. I really do appreciate each and every one of you. Um, if you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel. Smash that subscribe button like Fletcher Cox smashes the running back coming through the hole. Ding that bell for notifications. And whenever, whenever you are done watching this video, please go ahead and give me a thumbs up down below. I'd greatly appreciate it. Your boy Philly Foothills here. Just catch up, like I said, on a couple of things. Uh, Jalen Mills has gotten, he got a pretty good contract from uh, the New England Patriots. So, you know, thanks for everything you've done for the Philadelphia Eagles. But um, I think we're on to better days without uh, Jalen Mills on this roster. I think he was a bit overrated. And definitely, definitely a uh, little too much swag at times. You know, he a little too much cocky, a little too much, little too much showmanship, things like that. But uh, Jalen Mills got a uh, $24 million, 24 million, four year, $24 million with $9 million in guaranteed. And it uh, looks like he's going to have a $2.5 million signing bonus with the New England Patriots. So... Yeah, we're definitely going to be probably, I think we're going to be in the market for a safety. I'm, I'm hoping we, we target one of these, one of these, you know, top, upper echelon safeties in the draft. So we're going to have to look for that. But because I don't think we're, we, we, are, we haven't been doing anything in free agency, as you guys have seen. We're broke. That's obviously the reason why. Um, and, I, you know, with everything that's gone on with with this team, with this front office, trading Carson Wentz, you know, more than likely parting ways with, with you know, multiple pro bowler Zach Ertz, which is a damn shame. But, you know, when time it's, is time to move on, it is time to move on. But like I was saying, uh, you know, this is probably not a very enticing landing spot for free agents. You know, like I said, with everything that's been going on, and we also lost Rudy Ford, who was, you know, didn't play, who didn't start on defense as a safety, but, you know, he was a, he actually uh, was a cornerback um, too. I think he played both both positions. He was kind of a a swing DB, but I think mostly he played safety. But we're really gonna miss Rudy Ford on special teams because he played like 50% of our special team snaps this past year. And I think he was like, I think I was reading he's like sixth in, in special teams tackles. So he's going to be, uh, he's going to be uh, swinging down south to play for the Jaguars. And he got a two year, $4.2 uh, $4 million deal with the Jaguars. So, yeah, we're going to have to try to find, replace him on special teams, which is, you know, I, I think that he's going to be somewhat hard to replace when it when because guys who are really good at special teams like that they're 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 definitely you know they're definitely harder to find and they're usually um they usually get they usually get banged up too because they're you know they're special teams is no joke i used to play special teams in high school and i, and I could you know i could test for that you, you definitely put your body at risk a lot. You know, there's a lot of 
a lot of extra force and and um, velocity, momentum, things like that on special teams. So, yeah. So, Phil Billies. And it looks like, you know, I, like I was saying earlier, we're not doing jack diddly squat in free agency because we don't have any money. Uh, we are under the cap now from what I was reading. But uh, we still have the Zach Ertz situation hanging over our heads. Uh, and it looks like we have we didn't make any um, any any move with Derek Barnett so it looks like he's on a one year 10 million dollar deal which I think he is now gonna he is being overpaid um, I, I I would like to know what the what the the franchise amount is for the for the defensive end position I would be curious to know that because um, I, and I and I wanted to kind of uh, talk about just touch on two because I I mentioned that I think that I thought that the Eagles should have released him on the live stream that I did with Notion and and Tone to Shields and Philly Fresh, um, but I, I misspoke. I, I actually was me meaning to say that I I was hoping the Eagles are going to be able to find a trade partner for Derek Barnett because I think we've seen Derek Barnett's ceiling, and yes, I I know he is young. I know he's he came into the league at 19, which is absolutely crazy young for a football for the NFL. But I think we've seen a ceiling, and you know, prove me wrong, Derek Barnett. Prove me wrong this year, and you know, compete with Josh Sweat because I think Josh Sweat's better. I, I don't know about you guys. Let me know what you think in the comments. I think Josh Sweat has way more of a of we haven't even seen his ceiling yet, so he's got way more of an upside. And for the most part, Josh Sweat's been able to stay healthy, and that's been an issue with Derek Barnett. So uh, I think I'm going to let you guys go. Just want to make a quick video. Drop me some comments in the comment section. I'd greatly appreciate it. And smash that subscribe button if you haven't already. Become a Phil Billy. Join the Nest Out West, where I bleed green just as much as any Eagles fan out there. Ding that bell of notifications of all my videos and please give me a thumbs up down below i'd greatly appreciate it and until next time fly goes fly and stay mean stay green and thanks for viewing me on your screen peace